Hello, I'm here to show you my F Spectate script. Um, first, to start spectating, enter F Spectate in console. You will immediately immediately start spectating. To move around, use your movement keys. Um, you can see yourself standing there, always turning your back at you, but it doesn't matter. Um, anyway. Uh, move around by using the movement keys you can go up by using space and down by using the duck button uh, which is controlled by default um, to go faster press shift once it is a toggle so you don't have to hold it and to go normal again press it again and to go slow press the walk key which is alt by default um, which makes you go really slow while you are spectating you can make screens at certain places I mean all places you just look somewhere and then you press the Q button then you'll make a screen and you can make screens anywhere and as you can see uh, the flying thing me I'm not on the camera because I'm invisible the flying thing is invisible for other people remove the screens by pressing the context menu button which is C by default here you can also spectate objects and players let's start with of objects I've got a locker here and uh, when you look at it you press reload you'll start spectating it um, you can rotate your angle by using the movement keys going to the right, going to the left, going down, going up you can take more distance by pressing and holding space and less distance by pressing and holding the duck um, of course you can make screens uh, while spectating an entity too and um, here I'm doing that now, I'm now getting out of spectate uh, and I can hold the entity and the camera will be parented to its uh, entity uh, let's shoot it at that guy there. We camera all messes up, of course. And there's my object. And you can, of course, remove again by pressing C while spectating. Let's go to players now. Um, I'm starting to spectate by pressing my spectate button. And then let's go to that mini Chevy dude. Um, yeah, I look at him. I press reload. And I'm looking through his eyes. <laughs> He's prop minging. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter. Um, I taught him that. Um, anyway, I'm looking through his eyes. I'm not moving my own mouse. And when I press reload again, I get out of his body. Okay. Um, so now I get in again. Um, yeah. Hard to aim. Yeah, it's hard to aim when he's moving. That's why I made this. When I press the right mouse button, the men menu comes up, and I can choose a player. Let's choose that mini Chevy again. Um, oh, he's calling for me. Doesn't matter. He can wait. Um, he needs to shut up. Anyway, when I press Q, I make a screen, and it automatically follows his aim. And when I get out of spectate, it still follows his aim. See? Now I can do that to any player. Now I remove the screen again. And finally, um, you can change the size of the screens. Um, when you start spectating and make a screen, you can make this, uh, change the size by with this console command. F spec screen size. Um, the smaller the number, if I'm not mistaken, the bigger the screen will be. One is full screen, like you can see. Um, mm, let's do two and it will be half of the screen. About half of the screen. And The higher the number, the, the smaller the screen. Ten is not a useful number. Hundred isn't either, because it's like a few pixels. <laughs> Quite funny, but if you make a lot of uh, screens it will lag a lot your FPS will be like really low so uh, let's turn it back to 4.5 again you have to see for yourself what you think is the best uh, size for the screens that's your own opinion 
standard it's on five I guess or four and a half uh, but yeah, I'm not sure uh, 